Capaldi sends me a note yesterday. I wish you get Mike Tirico on. And I said, why? And then I thought, uh-oh, I, I better check something. You're being coy. He, and then I went, uh, well, I'm not supposed to know anything about anything. So Paulie says, uh, Mike Trico, uh, what what role? Or Seton goes, what role is he going to have at NBC Sports? And I went, oh. Oh, it's out there. All right. And I said, I assume he's going to take over eventually for Al Michaels. Al, I think, has two more years left on his deal. Mike Trico's deal was up now. So the mothership would have locked him in for another five years. And... You know, I mean, Tariko's not even 50. So he's he's been at the mothership for, what, 20 years? And now he could do Thursday night because Al Michaels is not going to do Thursday and Sunday. You don't want to take away the specialness of Sunday night football. So Al gets to do Sunday night football, and you'll have uh, Mike Tariko do Thursday night. Uh, NBC has golf. There's the Olympics. I don't know what else Mike wants to do or what else they've told him that he can do. If there's going to be any kind of uh, football involved in this or basketball involved in this, but Mike and Mike might be downsizing because Mike was doing a lot of games, a lot of traveling. And if you have a couple of kids, you want to make sure you're around to see, you see them before they, uh, they leave the door. So uh, no, it's great. That's a that's a great acquisition getting Mike Tirico. Yes, Paulie. The I team has some questions for you, Dan. A lot of people in the sports media are oh. curious your opinion. Okay. When did you first get an inkling that NBC was pursuing Mike Tirico? Uh, I want to be fair to Mike. I don't want to say anything about that. Okay. Because he he hasn't said anything publicly. I did exchange uh, a, a text with him last night. Uh, just say congratulations, and and that was it. Uh, because I I I don't know. I don't want to get anybody in trouble here and who was talking and when they talking and are you allowed to talk and who knows. All right. Second question. What else? A lot of people are asking, what does this mean for you, Dan Patrick? I don't know if it means anything. Because Mike's a play by play guy. You know, there's I'm I'm my I'm under contract for this year and next year with NBC. So Al and Al and I are up at the same time. I think right after the Super Bowl in Minnesota. I think we're up. So I'm, I'm signed to do these Olympics and Football Night in America this year and next year. Yes, he. So NBC's already taken the hit in the salary cap there. Yeah. With you. Of course. Are you and Al going to not show up to OTAs to, you know? Oh, no. I, if, if they want me to do Football Night in America, absolutely. Yeah, I have no problem. This, this isn't, I'm, I'm not Sam Bradford here. And Tariko's coming in as Carson Wentz. Not at all. Although, didn't Bradford have a two-year deal? Mm-hmm. Maybe Al is Sam Bradford and Tariko is Carson Wentz coming in. But see, Tariko's proven, so Carson Wentz is not. Yeah, Fritzy. Did Mike or his representation reach out to you for any kind of advice? I can't. I, 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 <laughs> Dan, I'd rather you not say that right now. Yeah. Uh, I have a good relationship with Mike. And if Mike ever had a question about NBC and my employer's, um, I would have been happy to have given him uh, my recommendation. The Dan Patrick Show, weekday mornings on Audience.